Hi guys, how are you all doing? This is your girl Fina. Guys, let's try another foundation today. Today we're trying a tinted moisturizer, not a foundation. Let's try the Fenty Ease Drop today. The shade that I have, I have um, 20 and I think 21. So I have two shades, 20 and 21. Ease Drop 2021. I do mix both of them together before, but let me see. Let's just swatch them first. Then the swatch would determine if we're going to mix them or we're going to use them separately. Now, before swatching, let me put on my primer. I'm using the Fenty Pro Filter Instant Retouch Primer. I need to get back that uh, True Matte Primer. I need to get that back. I need to get that back. I'm waiting for Black Friday. If the sales, Black Friday is not that good, I'll wait for Christmas sales. I'll be patient till I get a good deal. Why is it peeling off though? Do you see that? It's never like that. Why is it like that today? Oh. Do you see that? What? Oh God, I'm going out today and I forgot to put on my SPF. That's what I'm thinking. I'm like, something is missing on my face. What is that? Can you see that? It's peeling off. This is my first time noticing that. doesn't peel off before this is my first time noticing that I think I've been doing too much makeup because I'm doing it back to back by the time I'll finish this I did make up yesterday the one that I posted I'm doing it again today which is Sunday hopefully I'm going to post this one tonight and it's just a back to back and sometimes you allow your skin to breathe okay let it breathe because if you're not letting it breathe let's watch the tinted moisturizer if you don't let it breathe, you're going to break out. And I'm noticing that on my face. I feel like I'm breaking out. This shade is 20. Let me swatch the 20 first. That's 20. I think I'm just going to stick to 21. Hmm. And this is... I do mix them together before, but... Feels like... Let's swatch the 21. Then we'll decide. That's 21. 21, 20. See that? And 21. I think 29, 21 will be the right for shade. Let me mix the two of them together. The two of them together is not bad, but no i am going to stick to using just 21 let's try just 21 oh, let me pull more of i have a little bit of 20 there then i'll add 21 to it did i shake the 21 did i did i i can't remember shaking the 21 well whatever let's mix it ah mm. okay, please so I do Christian Ronaldo, it looks so bad. Really? Yeah. Yeah, the more you keep trying, it's going to look good. Can I show you how? Careful, though. Can I show you? When I finish. All right. All right. Oh, let me see, let me see. Though, let me see. I'm just... Um, tinted moisturizer. Oh, I don't have any of my foundation brush out. I would have used a brush. But let's use the... Let me use my sponge. Oh, this hair on the face today. Don't do that, please. This is not a foundation. This is a tinted moisturizer. So the coverage won't be as that of a foundation. For people that don't really like wearing foundations, this is 
ideal for you and this is good for summertime as well or maybe you're in a hot weather environment when the sun hits you hard your makeup will be dripping off your face you don't want that so lightweight moisturizer or tinted moisturizer like this is advisable I got the 21st I found out that it's too light for me then I got the 21 It's been a minute since I haven't used this. At some point, I was using this non-stop every time. And I got to a point, I'm like, okay, I think I got the um, NARS Light Reflecting Foundation. And that was how I just forgot about this. I was like, my friend, sit for a minute. <coughs> and I started rolling with that one. That's one thing with when you have a whole lot, you just forget you have something and just move on. So this is the um, foundation, tinted moisturizer. Not bad. The coverage is not bad. It's a medium coverage. You can see my hyperpigmentation. A little bit. Is your skin but better? So it's not covering all your sins. Just a little touch of your sin is going to cover. So if you're using this with the hope of all your sins will be covered, my brother, you lie. You lie. Am I saying my brothers? How many brothers wear makeup? Now brothers do. This day and age, brothers do wear makeup. So I'm going to say my brothers and my sisters, you lie. I'm using the Fenty Concealer in the shade 420 and 390. Let's put on the 390 first. This is the old concealer, not the new one. Because she came out with a new one now. Oh! Since I used the tinted moisturizer, I would have used the, oh, I forgot. I would have used this, the, what's the name of this one again? Bright Fix. I would have used the Bright Fix under my eye since I'm going natural. Oh, and the shade, wait. I don't mind. I don't mind. So I have 390 on my face. Let me add a little bit of Bright Fix. Why not? I'm not even sure if I have a whole lot here because I was using this at some point every now and then. Let me look in my mirror here. That is too much. The shade that I use is Toffee 14. I have Toffee and I have um, Honey Monsters. Honey Monsters is 11 but it's really bright. When I mean bright really really bright let me swatch a little bit but if i'm using i do mix the two of them so this is honey mustard you see how bright that is so i do mix that and this one here if i want to use them but today i am going to stick to the 390 and 390 and the toffee a little bit. I just hope this will be all right. I just hope the two of them will work. I haven't tried the Bright Fix with um, their concealer before. I just hope it will work. For bronze, bronze, I don't have any Fenty bronzer. I'm just trying to use most of the Fenty stuff that I have. So I don't have Fenty bronzer. I'm going to use my cuff case today because yesterday I wanted to use cuff case and I changed my mind. Today we're using made by neutral cuff case and the shade deep. This is the deep cuff case. Let's dip into, where is my no? Oh, I didn't bring that out today. Uh, let me go into, oh, this is going to, I just hope. I'm going into the shade, shade and lead. This one here, shade and lead. I think that should be more than enough. Oh, what is it with this hair? Please, just move away, man. That's too much. Jesus Christ. Hey. <laughs> I'm trying to take it easy today. Look at what I'm doing to myself. What have you done? What have you done? <laughs> That's too much. Look. 
am I going to clean that up now? I meant to put on my forehead, but I don't know if my hair is dry enough for me to take the band off. Jesus Christ. Mm. <laughs> this is so funny. No way. Let me use a beauty blender. This is dry beauty blender. Let me just use that and go over that because it's too much on the brush. I don't want to use all of that. That's too much. Look, even went all over my neck. <laughs> Today's makeup, eh? Jesus Christ. Some days I would do it, I'll be like, girl, you're getting there. And some days I'll be like, what exactly? <laughs> what exactly are you doing or what are you thinking? <laughs> oh, God. Mm. <laughs> I'm just trying to diffuse that a little bit. I don't want it too much. It's a little bit better. It's a little, it's a little, bit, it's a little bit better. I got excited. I got carried away. Like <laughs> I just dipped. I just let's blend the concealer. Time to face our direction. I'm just keeping my concealer here. I've tried several times. Whenever I join my concealer, my jaw concealer with the one on my, I don't know, just you see what I'm showing you. Whenever I join my concealer like that, it makes me look like what well, I don't know. I prefer keeping my concealers here, just like that. Honestly, thank you guys for making me revisit all of my products again. I haven't used this in a minute. I'm just starting with the ones that I haven't used in a minute. I will go around all my complexion products, hopefully. Before you know it, December is here. And I will now make up my mind. I know the ones that will join me and the ones that will say goodbye. Because we're definitely going to say goodbye to some of them. Some need to go. I'm using my foundation sponge. See, this makes my face look like, but because I don't know if it's the shape of my face, whenever I join it together, it doesn't look good at all. I think the two videos, I think my last two videos, I can't remember. The one before the last one. I was looking at the video, I'm like, Jesus, what is this? It was so obvious. It was so, so obvious. I didn't like that. I'm trying to do a little bit of reverse contour, but with just the sponge. You have to blend, 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 blend. Remember that, always blend, blend, blend. Now let's set under the eye. Oh. I forgot to use something, cream. I will leave it when I finish. I wanted to use my cream blush first, but I will use it on top of the um, powder when I finish. Let me set under my eyes. I'm using the Laura Mercier powder in the shade Translucent Honey. See, whenever I put this thing here and I go like that, it makes me feel like a proper makeup artist. <laughs> it makes me feel like I'm a proper makeup artist. Squab, squab. That's too much now. There's nothing to tap, girl. We're going to leave it like that for now. We're going to set it properly, but for now, let's leave it as it is. For all of our face powder, I'm using my Fenty foundation. 
soft matte powder foundation in the shade 410 410 powder just a little bit of that over my face I'm just trying to tap like that mm. let me just push it into my skin because I don't want lots of coverage I just want my skin but better kind of coverage but let me look this direction to make sure everything is looking good yeah everything is looking soft glam soft soft in a glamorous way I'm not adding extra bronzer today I'm good with what I have I'm just trying see I've changed my mind I'm doing a soft glam now no extra bronzer okay and for the blush I'm going to use a let me use a powder blush where did I put it let me use a powder blush I'm using the NARS blush in the shade exhibit a this shade here let's see what exhibit a will do on this face I'm just trying to pick that. This is their old formula. I heard they've reformulated it, but I've had this one now for more than two years. I think that's enough. Oh, but I'm not going to use it. I'm not going to use it. I forgot that I have Fenty bronzer in the shade Mokamami. I forgot that I have Mokamami. And Mokamami is just good days that you don't want blush, you put it on. With what I'm doing, I'm trying to do like a flawless makeup today. Mokamami would have been the best to use, but it's too late. It is too late. Let's just carry on with. Still with the Laura Mercier powder. I don't have Fenty on the eye powder. I'm going to go in with the all over face powder brush with nothing on it. How was your flight? It was okay. Oh. I'm actually going to Sorry, guys. I'm using my. This is the palette that I used today. This is the Revolution. What's the name? Revolution Makeup. Um, Revolution Makeup Revolution London. This shades beauty in a palette. These are the kind of shades that I play around with. I'm not that intimidated if I see something like this, but when I see colors, I just start asking myself, what do you want me to do with this? Where do I start? But with this, I know that regardless of what I do, it won't be that bad. Do you know what I mean? Like what I used today is this shade here, 420, and then mixed with Sundown, this shade here, and then finish up with Sienna. Those are the three shades that I used on my eyes today. And you can see I'm getting there. I am getting there one step at a time. My makeup is getting better. My eyeshadow is getting better. We're taking it slow and steady, no rushing. Fenty doesn't have setting spray, isn't it? Yeah, she doesn't. So I'm using the All Nighter, Urban Decay All Nighter setting spray. Let's use this setting spray. I need to lock it down for it to last. This spray here, look, I've almost run out. 
and we're going to repurchase this yeah it's a must this one or this one i've almost run out of this if i run out of this is either i replace this or i replace this one they are all owned by skin danovia isn't it yeah by skin danovia and this is skin danovia as well the makeup finishing spray are you sure i won't use this one pray for my skin because this i've had it now for years <laughs> yes this was my first setting spray i don't know why i know it has expired but let's go for it it's a very good setting spray if you are looking for a very good setting spray that will put your makeup in place very good This setting spray is really good. If you are looking for a setting spray that will put your makeup in place, honestly, try it. Try it. I've used it before buying all these ones, but if you see, ask me to date, Fina, which one is your best setting spray? I've always picked this. I don't know why. It just puts my makeup in place. I don't know if anyone, at least I've seen someone that like it, so it's not just me. Let it not be like, what do you mean? Why do you like this? Yeah, if I'm not getting back the all night, I'm going to get that. Let me just use my mascara today. Today is Sunday. Just still trying to finish up all my foundation. That is why we are here today. Otherwise, I won't be wearing foundation today. There won't be any makeup on my face today. Things I do for love, because I love you guys, so I have to do it. Let's carry on. Hopefully, I'm not going to stop till I finish all my foundations. You see why I like this mascara? I don't have lashes, but e.l.f. mascara, the two e.l.f. mascaras that I have, they do something to my lashes. I don't have enough, but... They are just there. So the one that I use now is the Lash It, Lash it Loud, isn't it? Yeah, Lash It Loud. And I'm going to finish that with the Lash and Roll. I'll climb every mountain. That's, oh God, why am I sweating? Just look at there. Look at how oily. I'm not finding this funny right now. Hope it's not lifting my makeup. I feel like I need to set there a little bit. I'm sure I didn't set that with powder, did I? Let me let me use the powder and set there a little bit. It's looking a bit shiny. Like let me just use the powder. Yeah, it's better like this. Oh, what's in my eye? There's something in this eye. Oh, there's something in my eye. There's nothing. Yep. There's something in my eye. How am I going to bring it out? Because if I touch my under eye, that is me lifting my... Yeah, see? Can you see that? I said it, there's something in my eye. Wait, 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 wait. Let me get... Ah! I saw one around. Oh, please don't move, don't move, don't move. There's something in my eye, is there? Did I pick all of them? Okay, my, I don't know if you guys can see, wait, 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 I'm trying not to tear up. Ooh. What kind of lashes? See why I always call my lashes? Look at here, well, let me bring you guys closer. Look at here, I don't know if you can see, look at that lashes. It's right inside, even if I push it away, it still goes back inside. So I need my, wait, let me... 
one. Wait, where is it again? No, it's out now. It's out now. What I would have done is just to plug it out. It's good now. What I would have done is just to plug it out. On our one, okay. Happy Bona Day, Ani Hum Birisha. I'm done. Let me take this off. Oh. Oh. The pain. The torture. Oh my God. My ear. Oh, sorry, ear. Wow, 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 wow. The pain. I can't even touch it. Like, literally. Talking, I can feel the pain. Whoa. Now I'm going to use my. Oh, the pain, the pain, the pain. I'm going to use my bronzer and then just go over the. I didn't add any bronzer, it's just that one. That leftover one is the one that I'm using. Oh, even touching here affects my ears. The pain. Oh. Hi. My grandma would say, Mama won't cook. Joe was Roba. Omo, Kao, is you won't The pain, the pain of trying to be beautiful is not here. Jesus Christ. Hair and makeup done. Ready. Oh, can you tell me what I'm missing? Please let me know. Type in the comment section what do you think I'm missing. We haven't done anything on the lips. Nothing on the lips. Nothing on the lips. I'm going to use... No, no transetter. I'm saving transetter. I don't want to use it anyhow. I'm using my... What shade is this? Date night. Morphe date night. Murphy day, night, and lip gloss. I need the little bit nude. I'm using the shade double booked. And then I'm going to add a little bit of Come to Mama. It's a light shade. You can see where I put the Come to Mama right inside, like that. And then I'm going to touch that up to cancel harsh line. Here. Yep, yep, yep. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Would I've loved to wear a lip gloss, but not today. I'm going to leave it like this. No lip gloss today. I think it's good like this. I don't need a lip gloss today. I think I'm going to leave it like this. So guys, that is the end of today's makeup. Thank you so much for doing this again with me. Thank you for doing this again with me, helping me to revisit my complexion products. And yeah, today we're going to see anyone that I use, if they are good, I'm not going to come back to tell you guys if they are good or not. But if they are not good, that's when I will tell you guys if they are not good in my next video. But at the moment, I've been using this for quite some time and the Easy Drop is a very good... Um, skin tint is a very good blurring skin tint like they said you can see it it's not doing too much it's not doing less it's just there okay that's as much as i can tell you it is just there is it a must have 
summertime i would say is a must have winter time i don't think you can get a foundation and pass at first if you ask me this same question two years ago i would say it's a must have because then i was using it generously like literally if not every day but when i got the um nas light reflecting foundation i was like okay light reflecting gives you a tint and a foundation depending on how you want to wear it when i got light reflecting i was like i don't think i need this anymore let me just stick to light reflecting but do i like the two of them yes will i repurchase it if it's on offer i will okay but for now we are trying to save with everything that I'm showing you guys, honestly, I don't think I'll repurchase anything again in the next two, three years. But let's see how it goes. Never say never. Never say never. When it comes to ladies and makeup, mm -mm -mm -mm. don't try and say a promise that you can keep. Don't say it. Don't. Don't. I, I didn't say that. I didn't say two years. I didn't. Because trust me, something will come out and I will go, no, I want to try that out. <laughs> but I've had loads of stuff that came out that I want to try. But I said to myself, you know what? What I see have here still works for me. Let me just stick to what I have. But one that I know that I really want to try is the House Last Foundation. And I want to try that foundation. I don't know why, but I know I'm going to try it at some point. So guys, that is it. That's the end of this video. Thank you so much for doing this again with me. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and turn on your post notifications so that whenever I post a video, you'll be the first to be notified. And I will definitely, definitely catch you guys again in my next video. Above all, don't forget to share yourself love, okay? Have a lovely day. Bye.